All right, here we are at our 25 feet 3 inch by 35 feet 9 inch floating cabin. This is constructed on a 42 by 50 foot float. Now that's the exterior dimensions of this cabin. On the interior, it is about 34 feet by eight and a half foot long and about 24 feet, uh, 24 feet, three and a half inches wide, which comes to roughly 843 square feet of interior living space. We've got about a 16 foot height on the exterior, nice large covered front patio area and a good size swim float. We've got basically a two two level jump platform and a wet water slide. And we are on a very popular section of Norris Lake near the uh, northeast corner. And this one has been in a rental program and it can stay in this same rental program. We've got a one, two, three, four step swim boarding ladder there. Large hot springs, hot tub. Picnic table, another swim boarding ladder up here on this front co corner. We've got some cleats and some, uh, basically some rub rail around the exterior that protect your boat when you pull up alongside of it. Stainless charbroil, charbroil gas grill with side burner. And you can see we've got some exterior speakers. We've also got a cell phone uh, booster, our cell phone antenna booster. I'll take you up to the top of this jump platform. And so this is where you can jump right off down into the lake and that one you can slide right off of there's going to be a water pump see we got a little timer right here oh, it's winterized right now otherwise it might be tempted to turn that on for you got to bring water over there and then on the cabin you can see we've got a metal roof vinyl siding vinyl insulated windows and doors this is constructed on lumber frame lumber frame decking and framing, we've got the new style plastic encased styrofoam floats that are underneath uh, this portion of the float. And then underneath the cabin side of our float, we've got the plastic encased styrofoam floats. Now the um, exact location of this one, where this is right now, is is not going to transfer basically uh this family owns two cabins at this marina this is the one they've had in the rental program and they're going to switch places with it but there's um with their other cabin the one that they're keeping but there will be a uh, basically a transferable mooring location right here at this marina it can stay in the same rental program um, and it will be connected to shore power. It's equipped with its own onboard lake water pump. Let me get you a few more shots here of our patio. And then we'll head inside for our walkthrough tour. We've got two faucets on the exterior for a water hose. We can clean your boat or even do some cleaning on the cabin itself. Got some lights overhead here on the patio, and we've got a little shade in the, I guess that would be the west corner of the cabin. It's gonna help cut down on that late evening, afternoon sunshine that you get. So uh, we've also got two speakers up here on the front porch. Basically we've got four exterior speakers, two on the side, two on the front. Get a nice, nice covered patio right here. I'm gonna step inside this insulated sliding glass door.
Now, I always like to remind you to visit the website for the current asking price, as well as the full list of features and specifications for these. Sometimes we miss things um, when we're doing the walkthrough video tour. So that's one reason we invite you over there. But the other reason is that's gonna be the um, where you're gonna find the current status of this and the current price. We don't mention those prices because they'll sometimes change throughout a listing until, until a uh, listing is sold. So we do um, encourage you if you're interested in this one, if you have questions about it, uh, we don't monitor our, the YouTube comment page. So if you do have questions, please take time to open up a new tab or web browser, type in yournewboot.com, click enter. It's gonna load our website. You'll see that orange lettering. That's kind of a just a nice reminder to let you know you're in the right place. Click the find your new boat button. That's gonna show all of our inventory and order price. And all you gotta do is scroll down to you to you uh, find this one again this is going to be the 843 square foot floating cabin this is a two bedroom one bath and again this is in a transferable rental program if you're interested uh, this is about a queen size sleeper sofa and we've got a 50 inch samsung flat screen television here in this living room and then we've got your we've got a sony receiver this has bluetooth um am fm auxiliary USB input and we've got a blu-ray player um, this is the inside of the cell phone booster and that's your um, zone control so we can um, turn on your these two cabin speakers or your uh, two exterior speakers it sounds like we got a low battery on one of our smoke detectors Two recliners in here, and then here's your dining table. Light overhead. Now we've got about a 12 foot cathedral ceiling here in this living room. Ceiling fan here as well. There will be some personal effects that will not be included with this one. Um, those are actually scheduled to, I believe, be removed soon. So whenever you come see this one in person, it'll be, um, you'll be able to see exactly what all is remaining. And what's not and we'll also keep a list of that so if, again that's that's a question if you want to reach out to us i'll be happy to provide that list for you uh, i believe this is about a 20 and a half or was it 24. it's a whirlpool side by side refrigerator freezer ice and water in the door that's a 25 cubic foot refrigerator and then we've got a whirlpool smooth top oven and range over the range microwave small little keurig uh, because this wasn't a rental program, it, again, it's going to be so turnkey for that rental program. So you're going to have a set of all the basic things that you need for your renters as far as your um, linens and things like that. Nice little island here in your kitchen. Some very nice low maintenance floors in here. Try to give you the full 360 degree tour without making you nauseous. That's our goal is to represent these as accurately as possible. But we'd like to move nice and slow so that we can watch this without having to take any nausea medication. So here's our two bedroom layout. We've got two king size beds. Small linen closet here just outside or more of a utility closet, I guess you'd say, right before you step into uh, one of your two king size bedrooms ceiling fan overhead nice storage closet your, your uh, power panel is back here in this room and this is a good size bedroom again plenty of room around this king size bed and that is a 42 inch samsung hd television i believe that's a plasma television Got DVD player for it here as well. And then we've also got a door to the exterior right over here. Get you a look in this closet so you can see the size of storage space we've got in here. Nice large closet. This is heated and cooled with a Goodman two and a half ton central heat and air HVAC unit. And then here is your full-size bathroom, tub, and shower. Then overhead, 
And then we've got a Japsco ring head. Bentley sink. And we've got an LG front loading washer and dryer. That waste holding tank, I'll have the size of that listed at the website. That is a marine head, so the advantage of those is they do not use a lot of water. And I believe that's what most of the rental cabins utilize here at this particular location. Here is your second king size bedroom. Again, ceiling fan overhead. Door to the exterior. Another good size closet. And this is also a second 42 inch Samsung flat screen HD plasma television. Blu ray player in this bedroom. So it's two Blu ray players, one DVD player, three Samsung HD televisions. Nice large closet in this bedroom as well. And I'm actually going to go out the front door, do a walk around the exterior, and I'll show you. We've got a small storage closet in the back that houses a 50 gallon electric water heater. Rub rail all around this side as well. We'll have some aerial shots of this one on our website so you'll be able to get a great feel for it. And this is in a very popular marina here on Norris Lake. And I believe home to the largest rental program lake. Here's our two exterior doors. We've got two storm doors back here as well. Here's that Goodman two and a half ton HVAC heat pump. And here is that storage closet that I was referencing. So what we have in here, we have a uh, electric well water pump that's going to pull the lake water up. It's going to run through this big filter, and then it's going to go through this Trojan UV Max UV light. Uh, and at that point, you've got um, hot water and cold water. Your hot's going through this, again, this is a 50-gallon uh, hot water heater. That is your uh, control module for that UV light. And then you'll see a battery right here. That's simply to power um, your 12-volt your, uh, your power. That's a 110 pump. Something in here is 12 volt. I can't remember what it is. <laughs> and also, you've got you've got light out here as well. Uh, you see some of this insulation back here. There is because that is a marine head inside of that bathroom. You've got 12 volt power for that. I believe a few other items. I'm going to show you our access storage space. This is just for reference. Now this could be turned into a large owner's closet. I've seen a lot of people do that, but we've also got some um, insulated ceilings up here and I kind of wanted to show you that as well, more so than anything else. Uh, your interior air handler is up here. And then here's where you've got that raised cathedral ceiling for the front half of this vessel. That's gonna be for your living room, kitchen area. A lot, now a lot of things up here are not included. This is where a lot of their personal items and water toys are stored but like I said I want to show you what, we, what you're working with here and that storage space well, back over to this side right here we'll wrap things up over here on this side dock actually might be able to give you a look underneath our deck here so here's the plastic encapsulated styrofoam floats and bear with me here. I'll show you one of our plastic and case floats. Give you kind of a look under the main cabin. So that is the encased styrofoam flotation. And then there's a look kind of underneath the deck there. 
This is floating. It's in some fairly uh, fairly deep water right here. I don't think the uh, boat I used today, I do not believe it had a depth finder. But you're probably in, I'd say probably 60 feet of water at Winter Pool. And more than that at Summer Pool. Where this one is currently located and as well as where it will be located uh, when this one is sold. So again, please uh, check out the website. For more information on this one, as well as the contact us, again, this is the 843 square foot, two bedroom, one bath, floating cabin for sale here on beautiful Norris Lake, Tennessee. That is the Chuck Swan Wildlife Area, directly across the channel from here. Um, that basically means that is undeveloped shoreline. That makes for a very peaceful stay here at this particular location but again uh, this is the website please direct any questions through there and I thank you again for joining us for this one and I look forward to working with you if you do have any questions about this particular cabin or anything else that we have for sale on our website again that is www.yournewboat.com and thank you very much for joining us again this is the 843 square foot floating cabin constructed on that 42 by 50 foot float.